Yo, hello everybody and welcome to the channel. So, I'm Nuru Fruit and in this video we're gonna be checking out the newest shop after the release of Fortnite Festival. And for this shop we got something really special which is new popular songs as jam tracks. Yes, you heard that right. So if you go to the item shop right now and you go all the way back to jam tracks right here, uh, because of copyright reasons, I'm not going to click on these uh, for too long because uh, if I do, it's going to play the actual copyright music and we can't have that. <laughs> I cannot like upload the video because of that. So I'm going to try to go through them really, really fast. Okay. So we got the vampire song right here. As you can see, it says new. We got thunder right here by Imagine Dragons. We got counting stars. We got I, we got the hills. We got bad guy, seven nations army, bad romance by Lady Gaga, Take my breath and save your tears by the weekend. All of these are free to claim. Uh, not free, sorry. Are <laughs> 500 V bucks away from you uh, to claim them. And basically, just once you claim them, you can actually use them inside Fortnite Festival. You can play the song inside Fortnite Festival, and you can also use them as an emote inside the Battle Royale mode itself. I already made a video on that. If you want to know how to do that, but you basically just you know use them as an emote, and it's absolutely awesome. It's super super dope. It's going to be like the new uh, toxic way to flex on somebody after you eliminate them. You basically just eliminate somebody. Uh, and you just play Imagine Dragons, you play uh, uh, like Lady Gaga, whatever you want. And I believe they can hear it, but it, it looks so, so amazing. So that's for the jam track right there. They also brought back a couple more uh, like uh, items. They brought back, I believe, the, um, the My Hero Academia stuff, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. I don't know why <laughs> like they brought it now, but it's here. So if you missed out on the My Hero Academia bundle, this is the bundle for you. You got uh, you get the All Might bundle, which includes All Might and his emote, which allows him to transform between uh, Toshinori, I think that's the name, and All Might. And then we have the Class 1A bundle, which includes three skins right here. We got Bakugo, uh, Midoriya, and uh, Ochaku right here. And of course, we have the gear bundle, which includes the pickaxes and the emote. And then, of course, you can just buy them separately if you only just want one of this one of these uh, skins. Each is going to cost 1500 V-Bucks. So that's what uh, there is in the item shop right there. Of course, if you're going to buy anything from it and you want to support me, please do consider using my code, which is Fruit, as you can see right here. You can find it in the description box below and you can just, you know, copy paste it. It really, really helps a lot. Uh, other than that, I highly recommend you grab at least one of these uh, music jam tracks, whatever you want to call them, because it, they're going to be they're going to be gone really soon. I, I promise you this is like probably going to be uh, like the last day, if not uh, like tomorrow. So they will be disappearing from the shop really, really soon. So probably just choose one, grab it and just have fun with it. And there's also going to be stuff that you can unlock like from the uh, from the festival pass. If you go to the festival pass right here to the main stage, go select the festival pass will open up. And there's actually like the top tier of the festival pass is actually free and you can unlock all of these jam tracks for free. So there's the uh, Butter Barn Hoe Down by Epic Games, the Take Me Higher uh, uh, like jam track by Epic Games as well. We got this one right here, Sweatshop by Epic Games. We got uh, Run It by Epic Games again. And there's the Brace for Chaos by Epic Games. So all of this stuff right here as jam tracks by Epic Games. And there's also more, of course, in the mode itself that you can play. Uh, but as emotes, you can only use like the stuff that you can unlock, like they're already unlocked. And if you pay 1800 V-Bucks for the premium pass, it will unlock the bottom tier right here. And it'll give you these popular songs. We got My Songs No, uh, like Fallout Boy, My Songs No, What You Did. <laughs> I'm trying not to play them too, uh, too much. And then we got the Gangnam Style by Psy, which I'm really excited to unlock. Then we got uh, Poison by Bill Dev DeVoe, Bill Dev DeVoe, and then we got uh, Blinding Lights by The Weeknd. So again, these are very, very, very popular songs, and uh, yeah, like uh, you probably one of the songs is probably 90% of the time one of them is probably your favorite song, and you want to have it. So I highly recommend you just grab at least one of them, or just you know buy the pass and just you know enjoy the free stuff that you get from it. Uh, but yeah, that is pretty much it for today's item shop. Also, in case you guys did not know, you can fully customize your character using new stuff like instruments, auras, and jam tracks. Just go to your locker and you're going to see a lot of this new stuff added. So for the cars, again, you just whatever car you have, you can just uh, add it and just customize it with wheels, decals, and car body. Then for instruments, you can choose the uh, instrument edit style. Epic Games did us a favor and gave everybody the default stuff. So you get the opening act guitar, the first uh, bass, the, uh, the Garage Classic Drums, the Mic Microphone, and the Kitar Classic Kitar. And each one of these can be customized through the color. So you can just change the color however you like. Not however you like, I guess you have to choose <laughs> from these four colors. So it don't really give you a full range of colors that you can choose. So I really hope they, some some sometime in the future, they add like a, like a hue thingy. I don't know what you call it, like the circle of colors. Well, the one in Photoshop where you use any like you choose any like hue of color or nuance of color and just use that. I think I think that would be awesome. It's not really that that it shouldn't be that hard to do. And again, for the uh, for the other stuff, same thing. So that's for the instruments right there. Uh, next for the jam tracks. Again, you can add the jam tracks that you own here. So right now I have these two free jam tracks. I haven't unlocked anything new, 
but once you add them you can actually use them as emotes so make sure to add them you can only have uh eight per like per game so make sure to add like your eight favorite ones and once you do that you can jump into the game and, and use them but before we jump into the game i'm just going to show you the auras so these are the auras right here that everybody's going crazy for and uh, sadly these cannot be used in fortnite battle royale as you can see it says right here only usable in fortnite festival so there's the uh i have the on fire aura and this one is right here, which is my favorite, the um, the Rift Rock, because it looks like Goku is going into Ultra Instinct, which I really love. So we'll jump into a game right now, and I'm just going to show you what the uh, what the emote looks like. All right, here we are inside of a game. And as you can see, once you press your uh, emote button, so for me, it's B, you'll find this new uh, Locker Jam Loops. If you click it, you'll find these new like uh, uh, like uh, emotes. So it's based on your jam track. Again, I only have two. So just click it, and it'll play. Of course, it is like copyrighted, so it's not really going to play the music for me. But you can actually change the loop by pressing B. And you can even change the tempo and key. So if you click E, you can change the tempo right here. So make it fast or, uh, or slow. And you can change the key like it's C, D, E, whatever. So And then, of course, you can go from major to minor, whatever you, wanna, whatever you want, of course. So that's how you do it. You can also change the, um, the instrument that you're using. So if I go like this, I'll use the bass. Which I'm pretty sure it uses your version of the bass. So if you have like custom, custom customization on it, it'll show that version of it. So this is the uh, the the vocals. Pretty dope. If you have Eminem song, of course, and you have the Eminem skin, you are gonna start rapping, which is insane. <laughs> so imagine like eliminating somebody and then rapping on top of them. I think that would be the sickest, uh, I guess, brag you can ever do. So let's me show you just the final one, which is. What was it? We did drums, we did the bass, and then the lead, which is the guitar. Oh, I guess the guitar. <laughs> so yeah, that is the uh, basic idea. Again, just collect jam tracks and ink and shoes, whatever you want. Just use them as emotes using instruments and jam tracks, which is absolutely amazing in my opinion. One of the coolest additions to the game. So let's go back to the item shop. Uh, I gotta say, like this Fortnite festival, uh, in terms of ranking, if I had to rank all of these modes right here, the newest one, the Lego Fortnite Rocket Racing and Festival, I think uh, Fortnite Festival is number two. Number one is definitely LEGO Fortnite, and you can already tell by the people who are playing. So LEGO Fortnite, it has 2 million players almost, like, playing it right now, actively. And then Fortnite Festival, it has, uh, like, divided between the two the two modes. It's got 380, let's say, or 90,000 people. And then we got 300,000 people playing play Rocket Racing. The reason why I'm, I'm hating on Rocket Racing is because of the item shop prices for the cars. I think that's... Uh, just it's ridiculous man the price tag is ridiculous $40 for a car is just absolutely stupid so like this right here these are bundled for $40 for this it's just you know the, nobody can afford this man some people can but most people can't and I really dislike the fact that they're trying to milk people as much as they can just especially people who come from Rocket League and they want to enjoy Fortnite and yeah they want to have like their favorite car they probably run the diesel or the octane or whatever uh, people want their, their Jaeger to be here and yeah, they just have to buy this for uh, a very, very like high prices. So a very bad price tag, in my opinion. That's what makes Rocket Racing the third and least favorite, in my opinion. Number two is definitely Fortnite Festival. Just because of the songs and the, the, like the vibe itself, like the Guitar Hero vibe, I think it's pretty cool. And I love the fact that they added emotes, that, like the jam tracks, you can use them as emotes in Battle Royale. I think that's a very, very, very nice addition. And finally, of course, LEGO Fortnite is definitely, definitely, definitely my favorite. Just because of the fact it's like the the one that is truly 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 uh like uh player friend friendly what i mean is that all of your uh skins from your locker will automatically transform into lego skins you don't need to buy lego skins like you probably own a bunch of free stuff or a bunch of battle pass stuff uh over the year that you played fortnite so all of them as you can see like transform we got midas right here we got pd we got agent agent midas uh, not agent, agent uh sorry agent jones there we go. This is one is my favorite. So as you can see, like you get a, a tons of free Lego skins. You get the open Lego world, uh, like uh, like mode that you can play in. You can play with your friends. You can make stuff. You can survive. It's it's very very player friendly. And even and even came with two free packs, like the True Explorer, uh, the True Explorer pack, which was free, and the Explorer Emily, which is also a free skin that you can unlock by linking your Lego account with your Epic Games account. I think that event already expired, but I'm not too sure. Uh, but yeah, that's that's why this is by far my favorite. Lego Fortnite is by far my favorite mode, and I believe if you go like this as a Lego, yeah, you're gonna transform as a Lego. Let's see if uh, let's see if the weekend becomes a Lego skin. I want to see that. I really want to do. Let's see, Lego. Nope, he <laughs> does not transform. So he becomes just a random Lego skin. And let me see just for my Hero Academia here. Nope. Also, they don't transform. 
So all the way back here, this stuff transforms if you want, like Wukong, Jonesy the First, Siren, all of these skins are here for you to grab if you want to. Again, if you're gonna buy anything from your item shop or you're gonna buy or you're gonna buy a battle pass and you want to support me, again, please please do consider using my code because it really does help a lot. It doesn't really have to be my code, you can choose anybody as long as you use somebody's code, it's always good. So choose whoever your for like your favorite content creator is. Hopefully it's me. I'm honored that it's me, and just use their code because it really does help. And yeah, that is pretty much it for today's item shop. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.